Well, doing business with Matthew's brothers actually is contagious. From the beginning of the uh, process right through the end of the process, and that's with the quoting, the people in manufacturing, their delivery service, um, quality of the products, their enthusiasm to make great products, and after sales service. Not that we have a lot of that, but it's there if we need it. Plus, um, the fact that it is, uh, you know, run like a family business that you can call and you can talk to Judy, you know, you can talk to Dee, you can talk to a person, you can talk to the same person um, time and time again. That, that certainly means a lot to us because uh, that's how we run. You know, we, we want Having to been up to the factory and been through the tour, I can say personally it's a very impressive operation. Um, they, their ability to customize all their product lines and to produce the product quickly and get it into the field when we need it is a real advantage to us. Uh, I, when I think of Matthews Brothers, I think of a company that, that is just focused on making things work well, producing great products, having communication systems with their customer that are effective and making sure that the end user has a great experience. And Matthews Brothers, from my perspective, is one of the most focused companies that we work with. They're all about just doing a good job, having things work well. I would say the one thing that uh, jumped out at us about these particular windows was that they were all pre-cased on the outside, which is something that we generally don't deal with. And so I think everyone was a little apprehensive about what the finish was going to look like, what the product would actually be. Um, and we were really pleasantly surprised. Um, the windows went in very easily. They functioned great. And um, the part that we were most concerned about, the, the pre-finished trim on the outside, uh, looks great. Well, it's been a long time relationship. And uh, we're a fifth generation company and uh, we started in 1844. So our roots are deep as our Matthews uh, window company. And we started doing business with Matthews Company back uh, with my grandfather, I'm sure, uh, when we bought SSB windows, single glazed windows. Uh, and we used to stock SSB windows uh, when I first came into the business. Well, um, one of the things that, that's very impressive about the factory. It's state of the art. It's, it's equal to what you'll see if you go to some of the big national brand factories. And the people that you see working in there, um, it's a professional atmosphere. And the, I, I think that shows well in the product. Uh, I was very um, leery, nervous, uneducated about the product. And given that the windows there's quite a few windows in here. It was a substantial part of my rehab budget. Uh, I was nervous putting in something that maybe would not be as good as the Pella or the Anderson. And then as I looked at it more and more, looked at the construction, I felt pretty good about it. And then when the product finally came in, I felt great about it. So. And then my salesman put me on to Matthews Brothers. And at first I was a little skeptical because we put everybody's windows in. And they all promise you, yeah, this is going to work and it's going to work. And then when you get out to the field, you've got to kind of uh, be a magician getting them to work. Um, again, the, the big problem was because it has aluminum siding on it. We couldn't, we couldn't get anything to work. And Brian, my salesman from Leader, put me on to Matthews Brothers. And uh, the window came out. We put it in and it fit within a sixteenth of an inch. And from that day on, I was just like so. Well, what we do with any of us, by the way, it's Roger or anybody, we go to people that take care of us. We go to just certain suppliers because we know if we got a problem, the main thing is the customer gets taken care of. That's why we like you guys and do business with you because it's been... I tell everybody when I sell lines, when it's like buying a Cadillac at a Chevrolet price. It's just uh, I have in my own house. I mean, I, most of my employees either built new or replaced windows all have a line just for the certainty that they know they're going to get taken care of. There's a problem. You guys are 35 miles away. There's every piece that's made that window's there. It's not like you're going to Wisconsin and uh, Timbuktu. It's there. High quality product. Uh, you know, pride in manufacturing and then doing it right. Um, 
unique in that uh, one of the oldest and uh, still uh, you know, making the, the traditional wood sash and the glazing and had some real artisans working for them over the years that uh, as a kid it used to be amazing to go down there and watch people glaze windows and, and everything they did. Um, you know, we was talking about that the other day and in the three years I'm not sure how well that factory service is because we've never had to request it. Is that right? Yeah. You know, which has really been just amazing to me, you know, because we, you know, because we have another window company that we work with with a much higher volume, but it's an aluminum window, but still the ratio between the amount that we sell compared to the service work that we need to call for, uh, the fact that we've had none is nothing like I've ever seen before. Anything at all, whether it's been hardware or balances or glass or anything, so it's been good. It makes my job easy. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Oh, because they're um, even if we're not super expensive windows, but they have a fantastic product. But the other key part, in my opinion, was that they're relatively local because all the window manufacturers that come through my office are. Um, you know, they're from they're manufactured very far away, or the, the most expensive ones that the architects want to use are all manufactured in Europe. And as far as I'm concerned, we've got great windows here in the US and Matthews Brothers are great windows. So it was a it was a win win situation. Well for us the fact that Matthews Brothers is a main based company gives us lots of confidence, especially when uh, anyone stops to take the time to go to your facility to actually see the people that work at Matthews Brothers to see the manufacturing processes you, you um, it, it's not an overstatement to say when you go to when you go to your facility the employee commitment to quality the employee engagement the employee pride in what Matthews Brothers does it literally jumps out at you. you. You can actually feel it. You can see it when, when you go there. And, and having been to many manufacturing facilities, that's not usually the case. And what Matthews Brothers has in a, in a work culture is truly different. It's unique. And it definitely is, to some degree, uh, built from the fabric of Maine, and not just the fabric of Maine, but the fabric of of coastal Maine, of down east, of down east Maine. It's um, it's pretty cool and it's pretty unique. Hi, I'm Tim Bernard, Crescent Lumber owner. My name is Scott Nori, uh, the vice president of sales. I'm Sam Collins, SW Collins Company here in Caribou, Maine. Uh, how you doing? I'm, my name is Pat Bonaparte. I'm uh, president and owner of Construction Managers and Developers, located in Somerville, Mass. Um, Michael Hutchinson, I'm the sales manager here at Cold Bill and Supply in Amherst, Mass. Um, my name is Josh Howell. I own JD Howell and Company Custom Builders, and we're located in Walterboro, Maine. Hi, I'm John Roberts, and I absolutely own Matthews Brothers Windows, and I will go no place else. Hi, my name is Jeff Carpenter. I'm Vice President of Sales at Ed Harrington Incorporated. Uh, my name is Jason Studeheit uh, with DP Porter Contractors right in Herman, Maine. Yep. My name is George Fontaine. My company is Fontaine Contracting. I'm based in Wilbraham, Massachusetts. And based on this job, I'm a Matthews Brothers fan. Uh, I'm David Flanagan, um, and I'm uh, one of the family members that owns and runs Viking Lumber. My, my name's Dave Saper, working at IT Pine. My name's Charlie Plord, and our company is Northeast Equipment and Supply Company. We're a building contractor in Waldo, Maine. I'm Kevin Hancock from Hancock Lumber Company, and I love Matthews Brothers and Matthews Brothers products.